Hi, welcome to the first episode of Nintendo Legend Versus, where I pit my opinion against that of another retro game reviewer. Today's guest is Chris Osborne from JuggleChainsaws.com. Now, he's on a mission to review every American-released NES game, much like myself. However, he's doing it in the order of their chronological release. Now, as much as I love his mission and what he's all about, I do occasionally disagree with his reviews, one of which is Pro Wrestling, which he gives a thumbs up. Pro Wrestling is an early NES wrestling game that some people remember with fond, sentimental feelings for its whimsically named wrestlers and the infamous Winner Is You screen. But this cartridge is not as great as you remember it, and simply is not a good game. But let's see what Chris has to say. First things first. When I started the game, the title screen had color and noise. You know, when I poop... There's some color and noise involved, but that's no reason to celebrate. Come on, Chris, what's the real reason you give this a thumbs up? Talking about the in-game rankings system, he says, I'm assuming that means you can lose matches later because I wasn't able to actually win one. Wait, what? You weren't able to win a match in pro wrestling? I'm sorry, but that erodes your credibility a little bit. The fighting really isn't anything special. Dude, this is a wrestling game. If the fighting isn't special, what else is there? One nice touch is that the referee is always in the ring. Oh, I got it. It has a referee. You know, that's just the mind-blowing feature it needed to really send it over the top, you know? In the end, this isn't a wonderful game. Well, okay, then we're, we're in agreement. Moving on. It's a solid title. No, it's not. Maybe solid like a turd, or you have a warped definition of the word solid, but no, this is not a solid title. So, Chris, what do you have to say for yourself? Pro Wrestling Rebuttal from Juggle Chainsaws. Okay, I realize that the title screen having color and noise should not be a big deal, but Nintendo games just hadn't done that yet. So, really, come on. Look at all the other games Nintendo has put out. You have a plain black background, for the most part, and you get to press select of all buttons to switch to a new thing. All of a sudden, you have color all over the place instead of black and there's sound i mean come on also i don't really like wrestling games i'm not good at them which is weird because i like fighters so yeah i didn't win a match the game got a thumbs up it doesn't mean it's a great game it's sort of like a zero or one system Zero is for games that really, really suck, and one is for games that don't really, really suck. They might still be bad, but you kind of need to play them. I think part of me saying that the fighting isn't really special is because I've gotten used to Street Fighter and other games like that. I mean, even Kart Fighter, the really bad homebrew game that it is, has better fighting than this one. I like the ref in the ring. It makes it more realistic. He doesn't just magically appear when needed like other games. So it's cool. You know? It, it's really not a wonderful game. But as far as wrestling games go, at least for the regular Nintendo, you know what I mean? It's probably going to be about as good as we're ever going to get. Unless somebody comes back and makes a really good homebrew wrestling game now. <clears throat> Solid in the fact that it's not terrible. It's worth playing. I mean, if you want to go play a wrestling game for regular Nintendo, your other options, at least as far as I've looked at so far, are pretty, pretty bad. And I remember a couple other wrestling games that friends had that I haven't gotten to yet, and they're really not much better. So, 
I mean, wrestling games, yay. You know, go play pro wrestling. Don't play muscle. Because in the end, really it all comes down to this is a wrestling game that's not muscle and it's not tag team wrestling. Everything else is worth taking a look at. Those two are worth playing if you're drunk. And that's probably about it. All right. Fair enough. Some decent, honest insights. I appreciate that. And it sounds like, in the end, we're not in complete disagreement. So, that's cool. But if there's one thing we can agree on, it's this. Don't play muscle. <laughs>